Definitely needing it. Come on first, is to stand up all, put the legs out, come down as so much, a little bit further down than the lower back, and into the side. Uh, over to the side, gentle stretch. All right, you're going to get a little stretch in this too, it's okay. Come on, pull it over to the side. Other side, pull it on over. Put your hands down on your legs, push them back. Twist and do it with one side. Twist in with the other side. Hey, monster. All right, come on down, Clint. Come all the way to the mat this time first. Put our feet out there. Butterfly them out. Pull them in. I have a cat in front of me too, right? We always have that like the challenge of trying to do something with a cat or kitten. Right? I'm just trying to get my face well. I'm pulling yourself forward. So our feet are butterflied out. We're pulling ourselves forward. Come on up. First twist of this stretching series. Twists really help with the bloat. There's some other moves that help with the bloat, but they also help with the legs and the shoulders. So when you're getting them in, come up a little funny, but we're going to do them anyways. Get that in there, really pull that back. You're pulling back, you're also stretching your glutes. And twist and do it. Bonus, bonus. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Other side. Okay, we're getting that twist in there. Over here. Stretch out the glutes too. Arm to the side. Look back at it. Sit up tall. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, five, nine, ten. Come on in. Come on up on the all fours. Cat it up. Oh, cow down. Cat it up. Really push it up. Cow it down. Step it back. Push back to down the dog. Get that stretch in the back with legs. Get the stretch in the shoulders. Come on down on your knees. And this one looks funny, I know, but it also, it's called puppy. The puppy also helps for bloat, too. And it stretches. I like before we need stretch right now. <sighs> Come on up. Cat it up again. Cow it down. Now you can either stand up and do a knee tuck, or you can stand on the mat and do a knee tuck. Either way, so you can stand up or on the mat, either way. Now some of these moves I've done a couple times this week. It's just with the, um, with the squats and everything, I'm trying to keep the quads and everything. Stretch out, grab that foot, pull it in. If you're standing up, just really tuck it in really good. You could pull that foot if you, if you could, but that's the hard stretch, have hard balance there. Feel it, and you should feel a really good stretch. Pull it in as much as you can. Let it go. Other leg first. Pulling it in. It's the cat pretty much pushes me off of my mat. I know. Okay, so now the next level. Grab that foot and really pull it down. Come on, keep that other one straight. Pull it in. All right, come on up. You could do forward fold, or you can all standing, or you <clears throat> come back to the mat and forward fold over the 
those legs because we're going to do one leg and the other leg. So you may want to come back to the mat. You weren't laying down because you did one leg on your back. Forward, forward, forward. Come in with one leg. Other leg out. Lean over it. Now, same leg. Leg is out, and you're up and over it like this. Other foot, first thing first, and over it. Come on up, up and over, and lean into it. We're going to push back, downward dog, step it forward, we're going to three legs step forward, we're going to do the twisting lunge, give that a little twist in there, okay? So come on up, step it back, downward dog first. Step it forward with one foot, get in that lunge, pull those hips down, twist it away. back, step it back, push it back again, my dog. Other relax, sits forward, get in it, pull those hips forward, twist into it. Come on back, both knees down, push it up to cat again. Kind of move the hips a little bit. Whatever angle you're going, go the opposite way. Push that really good. Step it out, lower yourself all the way to the mat. Curl the toes backwards, push yourself up. Come on up. Push back to child's pose first, straight back. Now, opposite hand over. Come on down. Over the side, twist to that side. Back forward. Other side, hands out, other one's over, pull yourself back. Oh, come on up. Gentle back then. First things first, both hands back. that lunge. Yeah, get the kitty cat shook. Oh, just to do it again. So what a shot time after this. 
really good. If you're really twisty, you should really, look really good in the glutes right here. As you're twisting through it, your core and your shoulder. Now go. Five more step back. Put the leg in. Twist and do it. Come on up. Both legs are out. Hands on the hip, on the legs. Twist first, foot over. Twist the other shoulder. Come on up. We're gonna go forward, walk it back. Then we're gonna twist to one leg. We're gonna come back, walk it back, and twist to the other leg. Okay? And then come back and walk it back one more time. Okay? So first thing first, forward fold, and walk it back as much as you can. Get that stretch in. Three, four, five, six, seven, nine, ten. Over to the side, opposite hand to that foot, just into it. One, two. Two, one. Back center, walk it back. Other side, pull around that foot, pop the head up, twist into it. Come back, grab those legs, pull into it. Hands down, walk the feet up. Forward folded. And all the way up. Okay. Those are just the stretches that I needed. And yeah, like a knot right here. I'm just trying to get that with the twists and the other ones too to try to get the knot out of my quad. I will do one more ah, quad stretch to add to it. I think that might be one of the reasons why my knees bothering me is I have a string right here. And you string here, it just goes right on down. Other leg. All right, so these are checked off. Today's been a fun day. We had our cardio with punches in it. Then from cardio, we went to tricep work for 100s for different extensions. And then for the triceps, went to 100 sit-up punches variations. And then from that, went to our 100 squat knee to elbows. And into 100 push-ups with some different variations for those. And then stretching. So next week, I'm going to put them together a little bit differently. So if there's something you want added, remember, then let me know. Otherwise, I guess we're going to continue to finish it off with a stretch each day. And I hope you're stretching. But this today, this week is checked off and 